Hey everybody, welcome back to The Witcher 2. I figure since we are outside of Lorito's place, uh, this is probably a good time to go and chat with him. Uh, we had to talk to him in the evening anyways, so hopefully he's awake and these guys let us past. What? The Commandant wanted to see me. Leave your weapon here. Guard it with care. It's very valuable. Wait, Wolf. I need to talk to the Commandant too. You going inside or not? Listen, friend. I'm an officer and you're a runt. And when I say jump, you will not only... Come on, Roach. <laughs> yeah. Subtle, Roach. Very subtle. With these cunts, Lerido couldn't protect the port from a drunk lumberjack, let alone Yorveth. He succeeded so f A ballista. The bastard's got a ballista. You know the power of this weapon. Yeah. Mm. It's we armed, strengthened walls. with bronze plates and strung with horsehair. It can propel heavy bolts up to a mile away. Yeah, an experienced crew can release two bolts each minute, but it can't hit the same spot twice because it recoils and shifts. <laughs> I've heard that somewhere before. Where yes, did you learn have. about Ballista? I knew someone who knew a bit about them. Unimportant. We need to damage it if we don't want to be at Lorito's mercy. They're all drunk here now. I'll provoke the guard. Relax, Roach. I don't want to fight this rabble again. As long as that weapon's operational, no one will sail this section of the Pontar without Lorito's express permission. I'll handle this. Go have a drink. Nothing better than a fireside feast. Already implementing feast. sabotage. <laughs> Except a fireside feast with copious amounts of liquor. <laughs> Add plow into the mix and it doesn't get any better. Luckily, the commandant. Don't you traits around here? Through. Yeah, I suppose <laughs> you wouldn't want me here, would you? Don't you traits around here? So long okay. as he can afford to tell it. It's got to be a way to get you out of there. For less than ten orans. As long as they don't mind me taking their stuff. Haven't had this good a time in ages. That's true. You know this one. Now, there are some training dummies here that I can't take down because I don't have my sword. Did you hear? Two big shots arrived. Wonder what they want. Dirty rotten scum. Plow them all. Plow them all. Do that again. And I'll fuck you, mum. Plow What you want, old man? Are you serious? Let's do this. I was looking to test my strength. Arm wrestling. What do I stand to gain? The other half of your hair. Because I'll thrash you. <laughs> and if I win, you'll have beat a witcher. So I guess that gets you bragging rights. Are you that good, old fella? The Grey Wolf? Mm hmm. All right. Let's begin. You've had your song. Care for some real. Okay, keep the indicator in Yellowfield. Yellowfield reaches. All right. Oh. It's so subtle. Oh, haven't had this good a time in ages. <sighs> That's true. Eat it. You know this one. A little Damn the dogs! <laughs> the old man got me. I need to eat. Build up a bit. Yeah, that's what you need to do. Oh, you are a fat, dirty, rotten scum. Plow them all, plow them all. They say witches again. have no oh, need to plow. Plow them. Did you know that? You've had your song. Care for some real diversion? Okay, how can we sniffing a sniffing around like dogs Who's in a white rubbish filly? That one about as Nothing better than a himself. fireside feast. <laughs> I'm wondering how we can get him to leave his <laughs> Add post. Plow into the mix and it doesn't get any better. Luckily, the commandant's provided it all. Sniffing True. around <laughs> like dogs Come in a rubbish dump. Your uncle's got a story. No passage. Okay, good. Things are going well. T Lorido's busy with that witch, Sheila. Come back later. Geralt, let's wait downstairs in the yard. Okay, Vernon, what's your idea <laughs> then? Luckily, the commandant provided it all. Yes? How did you plan to get rid of the guard by the ballista? I have my ways. But you wanted to do it alone, so go talk to the buffoon. Do we wait until the Honorable Lady is done with the Venerable Hick? Waste of time. Looks like a good number of Flotsam's town watchmen are here. We should look around. 
Did you see that arbalist behind the house? I'll we get did. his attention. Give him something to think about. Why don't you find out what they're guarding so closely? My apologies, gentlemen. I could not help overhearing your conversation. What do you want? In point of fact, it's a matter for the Witcher. I have an offer. Which is? An offer. Interesting. I suspect you did not come to Flotsam for pleasure alone. You suspect right. Do you know about the monster in the river? <laughs> Might have heard something. I expect someone will hire you to deal with it sooner or later. Thus, I presume that... Stop presuming, expecting, and concluding. Just tell me what you want. Our honored host is in possession of part of a trap, built especially for the beast in question. Go on. Around back, there's a storage area where Laredo keeps the treasures he confiscates from merchants and travelers. There are heaps of things out there. Let me guess. You know exactly where I need to look. Precisely. I saw Laredo's men carrying the contraption across the garden in a crate. They placed it on a platform by the wall, beyond which lies the craftsman's district. Why are you telling me? Why? We need to be rid of the beast as soon as possible. Good luck. All right. I'll distract the guard. You sneak behind the house. Brilliant as ever. True. <laughs> Come here, lass. Okay, now You're while he does that... Can I so not... long as he can afford to tell Don't you traipse around I'm here. I'm here for less than nope. ten orans. Dun, dun, dun. What do you want? Shut it, soldier. Have respect for your superiors or spend the rest of your life on the king's galley. Apologies, sir. I didn't realize. I just wonder if the other... Oh, jeez. I don't know if the other guy comes back. I'm gonna go with no. Oh! Yeah, unfortunately he just fell into his own, uh, you know, anyway. So, in the, uh, in the Sword of Destiny that I'm reading now, um, we're with, like, the company that's basically heading out to, um, kill this dragon. There's a lot of people involved. There's this young king, there's the Krinfrid Reavers, there's myself, there's some other magician. And now Yennefer's joined, and she basically joined and chewed me out. She's extremely pissed. She said it's four years since we last saw her. And, uh, she is not enthused. She calls me all sorts of names and, uh making me feel pretty bad about myself. But, um, it's interesting because I'm not sure where that four years falls into play, um, to what I read in The Last Wish, so I'm still kind of waiting to see if it's going to get pieced together or not. But, uh, that's pretty much all that's happened. It's taken a while to just kind of explain, like, all the preparations. A lot of people are concerned as to why a Witcher is there. Um, but Geralt explained that He's basically there for Yennefer, that's what he explained to her. And she's not super happy about that answer. Sheila, hello. Okay. So where are they all? another this guy might be tough maybe not Whoa, 
gold mine. Okay, we've got Iron Frame, Witcher's Robust Silver Sword, Astragaris Armor, and Fiber Enhancer. Hi there. Robust Witcher Silver Sword. Check out this armor. Okay, extra armor uh, by one. Extra vitality. Reduction of damage from magic, 2%. Resistance to bleeding. Resistance to poisoning. I think I'm going to take this, actually. Um, we lose out on some of the armor enhancements, but overall this one's still better. So let's take it. I don't believe I can remove armor enhancements. I don't really want to be up there. And I don't think I can get back there. we have here. We can descend underneath. That might be a good idea. But let's see if we can find this other fragment. Might be up where Sheila was. I'm gonna wait for this guy to come around and try and take him out when he goes around the corner there. That'll do. What do you think they would be using this room for? It's definitely some type of gathering place. Doesn't appear to be anyone down here currently. Forget who you're dealing with, Commandant. You must think me an idiot. I cannot help myself. You take guardsmen off the streets to guard carpets, fabrics, and spices pilfered from merchants. Do you have any grasp of the responsibility that rests with you? Don't teach an old man to piss, sorceress. I've ruled Flotsam for years. Flotsam is ruled by a fear of your veth. That fear rules even you. I've made my demands perfectly clear. Like a crying babe deprived of its rattle. In time, Commandant, they'll hang you by the neck from a roadside tree like a regular bandit. And rightly so, for you're no better. Your time will come too, sorceress. They'll pile kindling at your feet. Enough. Fear has confused you. Think over what I said and give your answer before it's too late. What is she trying to get from him? That's what I'm worried about. But we still don't have... Isn't there another, um... Piece of this trap? Let's see... A 
Callista. Doesn't say. Let's go looking. There's this thing here. Oh, it's locked, okay. Looks like it's inside. Serious? Can I be sure that there's no other way inside, though? What if I run across the top here, maybe? I'm not gonna like this. I didn't find any keys or anything. Haven't had this good a time in ages. That's true. You know this one. A little elf was skipping down the path. Didn't like him from the start. Laredo's storing valuable gifts from the merchants right here. He may be expecting Yorvith to attack. I overheard the Commandant talking to Sheila. I couldn't pinpoint the topic of their conversation, but it seems to me he's angling for something. We'll see what he has to say. You've had your song. Care for some real diversion? Alright, before we go in here and things get crazy... Let's see... I'm thinking... So, I want to start going into swordsmanship for sure, but... Um... I wonder... Yeah, I think I should go here, get the extra Vigor slot, and the extra regen, and a Mutagen slot. We also, we have a couple here. We have this one. Knockdown, Stun, Freeze, Incineration. This one's pretty good. This epic one's not bad either. Adrenaline generation on hitting a foe, because the amount of times we hit them um, could actually be pretty good. And plus, if we do this on two slots, um, you can see that it'd go up by 2%. That would go pretty quickly. We don't, we're not even using adrenaline yet, so... Go in. They await you. Oh, great. Where are we to go? I'd hardly call this a hut. You, I mean you, sir, cannot enter. We've been ordered to let in the Witcher, but no one else. Son of a bitch. Fine. He wants to play hard, we'll play hard. I don't want any trouble. I'll call for support. No need. Someone's Tell Lurido I taking got a the piss message. underneath us. That's See you, Roach. <laughs> Except a fireside feast with copious amounts of liquor. That's <laughs> flowery, Here to see the Commandant. We have business hey. to discuss. Good luck. He's in a foul mood. Why? We'll talk another time, and definitely elsewhere. Okay. What if we wanted to go the other way? I suppose this guard's not going to be too into that. No passage. Yeah, okay. Some containers are locked, you'll need a key to open them. Finally! They didn't want to let me in while the sorceress was here. Did you see her? Made up like a whore on parade day. They think they can do anything, those sorceresses. I heard what happened in Tamaria. You know your name's on a warrant. It's unfortunate, though nothing that should impede our dealings. See, I'm the law around here. 
and the law needs to know what the legendary White Wolf's doing in this session. I've been sending you people. I'm a witcher. I hunt monsters for coin. I suppose we all have our secrets. I just hope you resist questioning my authority in public again. What is it that you want, Lorito? Let's talk business, Commandant. I trust you're on our side. Whose side is that? That of the people of Flotsam, of course. Terrorized by the elven bandits for years now. I want to describe terrorized. A local conflict, none of my business. You killed some elves on the riverbank outside Flotsam. It came after me. You were me. attacked. You failed to understand. It's you who doesn't understand, Lorito. To tell you the truth, I'm not human. You an elf? A dwarf? No, talking bollocks. I piss on the fact that they call you freak for your white hair and glowing eyes. You're a human like any other. We're fighting a war. And you, my friend, cannot straddle the fence. Your point, Commandant? You're a witcher. Your job is to protect the simpletons from monsters. I protect them from the danger that lurks amongst the trees. I see where this is going. Yorvik's no better than a monster that attacks those who go out to gather kindling. Matter of fact, he's worse. He's smarter and crueler. How do we get him? I don't want you to kill him. Even you don't have a hope against his entire force. I have an idea, but I'd rather not go into it now. The squirrels are up to something. Every night their scouts come closer. I suspect they plan to attack the barge moored in the port. What's on the barge? You mean who? Bandits, murderers, rapists. On their way to the dungeons at Drakenborg. As soon as... Their infamous leader joins them. The cherry on the cake and Bernard Lorito's crown trophy. Couldn't have put it better myself. As long as your vet remains free, humans, elves, and dwarves will live alongside each other in deep distrust. How I've got bad to learn that what would the be. Rat is planning. How am I supposed to get that information? <laughs> you underestimate me, Witcher. True, I have my prejudices, but I'm not blinded by them. Take your friend Zoltan, for instance. He contacted Yorveth. How can Zoltan help if he can't go outside the walls? <laughs> step by step, Geralt. That's how you build trust. You could start by tending to a problem we have. A beast. The Karen has blocked all boat traffic. I'm losing tolls. Uh, that is, um, the trading post is losing revenue. Kill the Karen, and I'll declare your friends acquitted of their crimes. Then Zoltan can take you to see Yorveth. Hmm. Curious, what would he, what would he pay for Yorveth's head? I'm a witcher. I don't work for free. Of course you don't. Help us capture the Scoyatel commander, and you'll be rewarded generously. Straight from the trading post's treasury. Well, we'll tell him it's a deal, because I don't want to burn any bridges currently. I'll see what I can find out. Oh, you stir up storms wherever you go. I actually believe you'll bring peace to Flotsam. Don't disappoint this town, Geralt. Farewell. Any news for me, Witcher? You've got a heap of soldiers for such a small trading post. Bandits swarm to trading routes like flies to shit. Only troops can guarantee some order here. We're the last Temerian outpost in this area, and we'll not give in to a bunch of elves. Totally racist. I guess you're finding it hard to get rid of Yorveth. He's stubborn, it's true. But he's met his match. And I'm not about to leave Flotsam to the same fate as the other towns and villages the Scoyatella burnt to the ground. The citizens of Flotsam owe the elves nothing. They built their homes and workshops with their own hands in the wilderness, not on the ruins of an elven town. If need be, we'll remind the Longhears where they belong. Don't mind me, I just need uh, to borrow a few materials. So yeah, we could leave Any his news estate. But this, we need a key. Like, can we go upstairs? I 
I don't know. Nope. Entry okay. only on the Commandant's Express orders. Off you go. If we're gonna get snoopier, we're gonna have to come back later. Haven't had this good a time in ages. You know this one. A little apple skipping they down the say bar. Plow them all, plow them all. Along came a dwarf bag, kicked him in the arse. Plow them all, plow them all. Oh, you arse fuck, dirty rotten scum. Plow them all, plow them all. Don't you traipse around there. here. There's got to be a way. Plow them all. That one You've struts had your about song. as if he were the king Care for some real diversion. Uh, Good day. What do you need? Margarita. Ugly? Look, um... I wanted to surprise my friend up there by the ballista. I wanted to surprise my <laughs> friend, the sad-looking guy by the ballista. Some idiot wanted me to read him poems recently. Extravagance, as I see it, I didn't like it. I was thinking of something a little more traditional. What would you have me do? Whatever your specialty is. Just go with your specialty. All right, it'll be my standard rate. Draw him away from the ballista while you're at it. Slap me hard and call me stupid. Trying to put one <laughs> by me? That'll cost you more. How's that? Surcharge on special requests. Those are the rules. Let me think it over. A favor for a favor? There is one thing you could do for me. Oh, yeah? And that is? Myron and Alphonse, two of Laredo's thugs. Give him a good thrashing, and I'll even blow... I stirred up enough <laughs> trouble as it is during the execution. No need to stir trouble. Just humiliate them some ways. Yeah, we could probably Consider do that. Done. Nothing better than a hmm? Myron? Teach them a lesson yet? Not just yet. <laughs> Except a fireside feast with copious amounts. I don't like freaks. And I don't like oafish no necks. What do you want, mutant? I want to throw down. To try my luck. Arm wrestling. I'm gonna crush you, mutant. I already Save beat your buddy. Until later. Let's do this. <laughs> Add plow into the mix and it doesn't get any better. Luckily, the commandant's provided it all. True. <laughs> Come here, lass. Your uncle's got a story for you. So long as he can afford to tell it. I'll not lend an ear for less and than ten And down. Look how giant he is. I hate mutants like you. I know, I know. There we go. Hmm? Myron and Alphonse. Teach them a lesson yet? Of course. All right. I'm off to give the boy some diversion. Nothing you know, you're all right. Fireside feast. <laughs> Except a fireside feast with copious amounts of liquor. <laughs> Add plow into the mix and it doesn't get any better. Luckily, the Commandant's provided it all. True. Here for a little diversion, come here, lass. Grave one. Your uncle's got a story I'm on duty. Oh, come so long on. as he can afford to tell Your it. Your comrades are well at to having their fun. Why should you be any worse? You're right. Let's go. <laughs> that was easy. Oh, they're uh, getting right into it. Things like that, you could conquer all. <laughs> That's awesome. Uh, let's see if we have anything about the trap. We did get the one piece, but uh, I don't see that it triggered anything else. Maybe that was all we needed was one piece. This iron frame, I think. I'm pretty sure this is it. Don't forget your blade. Thank you for reminding me, actually. Okay, let's sort it by worth. That's usually a pretty good indication. But not always. Can't you guys get some lights going? There you go. Alright, cool. So, Laredo's talked to. 
Uh, really, he wants me to take down this Karen just like a bunch of other people do. Uh, let's see what else we learned here. She has enough talking. The other switch would never have to do things that way, but since the sorcerer slipping her finger might be mighty helpful in any situation, particularly ones that involve killing huge monsters. Haggle with the mon or with the uh, merchants at the harbor. I think the next thing we should be doing is maybe go and talk to the troll, um, get the recipe for the poisonous incense. We could do that from the shopkeeper, but um, you know that would, if we do that, then we lose our shopkeeper. And I don't know that that's such a good idea. Maybe right now what we'll do is uh, I'm just going to go and sell a bunch of our junk. And see if we can start building. Well, we'll see how much money we have. And how far we off from, how far off we are from the dark armor. I imagine still quite a ways. These guys, they don't work 24-7 around here. I guess not. Hello! So, how can we help you, eh? Okay, let's find our junk. And we can also get rid of a bunch of these weapons. Oh, wait, did we just... I think the ones that we have in here are the ones that, uh... are not equipped, so we should be okay. We could sell our blue stripes now, although it's not worth a lot, unfortunately. Enhancements we'll hold on to, the potions we can hold on to. Uh, we grabbed a bunch of snares. We could sell all these things. It does cause bleeding. Hmm. Let's get rid of them. Got some books, but really they're not worth a lot. Trophies aren't worth a lot either. Mutagen's a bit. So here we go, like Necker Teeth. This is worth a lot, actually. And we have a ton of them. We have a ton, so 412 Orins. Maybe what I should do is sell a bunch of the ingredients so that the crafting items, um, then I, then I own them, right? And then it's just a matter of collecting ingredients again. Like there, it needs leather, Indriga hides, robust cloth. That's fine. The armor requires, let's see. More leather, necker claws, which isn't a problem. We can get all that stuff. Diamond dust, right? The gauntlets require twine, cloth, venom, not a big deal. Let's see. The ultimatum. Ore. Hardened leather. Timber. Diamond dust. Necker teeth. See, and we don't need to sell all of them because we have some. We have actually quite a bit. It's the leather that we're short of, but we could probably buy that. But where is the other... Where's the anathema? Here it is. Silver ore, iron ore. We have a ton of iron ore. We could sell some of that as well. Necker teeth. Okay. So let's do this. Let's sell like 70 of these. Sell a bunch of these. Wait, did I just do everything we wanted to do? 
Oh, I think I might have resorted it. Necker hearts we can get rid of a bunch. So now we can start purchasing these things at least. Blasphemer's boots. Gauntlets. Anathema. Just one, please. Oh, insufficient funds already. Hey, these are a little bit more expensive, aren't they? What we could do is we could sell some of these things. Um, the iron ore we could sell a bunch of. Actually, we'd still need a chunk, so let's maybe sell, like, this many. Twine, we could sell a whole bunch as well. We could sell some runes, to be frank. But let's see how far this takes us. There's the anathema. Ultimatum's another 376. Here's the trousers. Really, we just need the ultimatum, which is need another 300 orins or so. I mean, we could get that with just the leather uh, and the necker teeth. It would be close. We get rid of some dust. get rid of the necker stuff like we can always get more that's not a huge issue i don't think get rid of some more cloth we have a bunch of timber i'm gonna get rid of all of that for now drowner brains we'll get rid of get rid of a bit more leather and some more necker teeth. We can always get more. That's 379. We need 376. There we go. So we have all of it. So. Now, what do we need? We're a bit short on studded leather and robust cloth for that. We could make the injury. Oh, this is not what we want. <laughs> Uh, more studded leather. We need hardened leather. Oh, I sold all my timber, of course. Of course I did. Trousers is leather. And the anathema. We need some silver ore and some timber. What we could do, just so that we have it, Let's see if she so sells we... timber. He does. Oh, I have to sell first. Okay. Seven. Oh my god. So. so now the... Let's see. Ultimatum. Oh, and we need 125 orns. <laughs> so. Jesus. I guess I could go and I could make money by fighting or doing some arm wrestling. Um, instead of trading everything that I have. What do we have that's really expensive? The whetstones. Yeah, I probably shouldn't get rid of these. But I am going to get rid of a couple. So how can Just to feel like we've accomplished something, really. Alright, so the ultimatum is completed. Now, I don't think that we want to equip these, am I right? I think we want, like, everything. Or it, or it starts damaging us or something. 
Yeah, see, it starts really draining our health. Which we don't want. So, um, we'll wait until we have everything. But, this is pretty cool. We're actually, so we have all the items. Um, what I'll do is off screen, I'll take inventory of what I actually need to buy and acquire. I'll do some math as to what it's going to cost, and then, uh, basically go farm some Necros and Indrigas probably to get all the equipment together and hopefully have enough to, uh, to craft it. I could also get some money from arm wrestling and stuff like that. Uh, I'm not sure if people want to see that or not, but probably not. Um, but yeah, thanks guys. We'll see you next time. Bye.